in your mouth. Sing it out. Hey, I'm para. your love unto the Lord right now. tonight uh, but there is a head of an enemy that must be chopped off uh, it will take the honor you give unto God search all alone go ahead open your mouth and talk to God find nobody come on work it up for me I looked high and low still could find nobody come on come on come on nobody Can you lift up your hands and give him that honor? If you want to go on your knees, whichever way, give him that honor tonight. There is power.
are giving me. Oh, I need a worship and oh, Now 
tonight uh. give it all to the Lord say hey, 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 hey. you are the Lord to you. It's all about the law. Give it all to the law. him the way you have always been doing. Be the game changer. Come on, change it up. Give him the worship you have never before. That's right. That's right. Don't hold back the tears. Can you love the Lord all over again?
kromotia yensa wo humopo kocha mansa wo da mansa komo e big suti wa no si wo di prekesa jama tu wo fiti koti ana wo bon afia hina kura no ne wo se titi botanga ya chiri wa yempa hwiarada Worship tonight taking you to another level of lying prostrate on the ground. Is it taking you to another level of lifting your voice to sound louder than your neighbor? Whichever way you can honor him tonight, give it all to the Lord. I am not here tonight to make a demand. I am here to give you what you cannot give yourself. Go ahead, worship him. Worship your own God. Worship your own God. Worship him. Something has been birthed. Hey. Let the heavens hear you. Yes, Lord.
I take off the old mask. Any mask, I take it off. Now, and I restore, I restore that glory they took from you three years ago. By the count of three, I give it back. Take it now, now. Take it. Yes, yes, yes. Take it back. One, two, three, four. Hold your hands. The four lanes. Yeah. Yes. From your lane, this lane, this lane, and this lane. You can you can join. Hold your hands. Place your hand on her shoulder. Yeah. Now you place your hand on her shoulder. I need a link. Yeah. Hold. Yeah. Yeah. Can you place your hand on her shoulder? Whilst we were worshiping Bishop, I saw, like, you know, when you go to places that they have this fire, this thing, when there is fire, the waters, saw a lot of them just here, and the, that was just coming down. And the Lord said to me, there's going to be an uncommon rain. Just hit, hold your hands. Lift her up for me. She saw the Lord. She saw the Lord. And she's not crying because of anything, but she's crying because some of them say, and they were the one fair. And come in far or sorry in the agro. And she's still beholding the glory. As for this one, if you lift him up, he will fall. You can lift him up ten times, he will fall ten times. Ah. Jesus. Father, in the name of Jesus. I hold let the let the rains now. Yes, yes. It is it is it is just pouring on them right now. And the Lord is telling me things are turning around. Things are turning around. I see a cat so beautiful. So beautiful, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and it they've written an amount on it, and then aha, aha, it is it is happening right now. <sighs> Let your rain, Jesus, still couldn't find nobody. This one is heavy, please help it. Nobody great, nobody great. This is just the first phase of the honor. The Lord is taking us to another level. 
He says, from today, your days of tears are over. You, again, you will not cry again. 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 Jesus, walk with me. Come. Jesus, the Son of God. Hold my hand. Uh, please stand around here. I believe in you. I believe in you. Somebody should walk closer to it. Jesus, the Son of God. Jesus, uh -huh. the Son of God. I believe in you, sir. I believe in you. I believe in you. I believe in you. Can you lift your right hand and say, I believe in you, sir. I believe. Yes, Lord. lady forgive me me <laughs> my prophetic this thing is not the level of this man but God is doing his own thing I just want you to know I am washing so all that is happening is just jara to the atmosphere it is only during worship atmospheres that you have a prophetic release so there is a prophetic release and if only you can tap into the atmosphere you will catch yours. I saw this lady on a stretcher. And I saw two ladies in my hair. Dressed like nurses. Then another man came and drove them off. And said you will not apply the wrong medicine on her. Then the man held her hands. Lifted her off the stretcher. And she began to walk normally. The Lord says I should tell her. That headache of that health. In her. That thing has been built something will happen just lift your two hands with me in your presence there's anointing and your spirit moves around me in your presence anointing breaks the yoke wherever you're standing just lift your hands the Lord I need a strong man please because something is going to happen. Ah. Your spirit moves you, how many children does she have? Come here, my darling. I saw twins. I saw twins. 
The Lord says I should tell you, don't be afraid of anything. And seal your ears to whatever you are hearing. Don't hear it again. I saw twins. And the Lord says I should tell you, start buying things for twins. The next time I see you, I will see the twins. Is your husband here? Is your husband here? Hosby, where are you? Who is the husband to this beautiful lady? Hosby, come around. Do you have twins in your family? Do you have twins in your family, my darling? Do you have twins in your family? Then you'll be the pace setters. I saw twins, two boys. I'll tell this to him in her presence. Chief, you have three weeks. Look for money. Buy something beautiful. Give to this woman. Some documents will be handed over to you. And you will come back to the person you used to be. The Lord bless you. Bishop, I was preaching somewhere last week. And then this man came to me with the wife. Some teenagers, two girls. And one was like, Daddy, okay, you are. I was like, no. Then she said, 15 years ago, you came to preach somewhere. I came to minister. You called me and said, I will have twins. Then she was pregnant and doctors have told her it is just a single girl. So when I said she will have twins, she laughed at me. And then she said, I told her, if I am called of the Lord, she will have twins. The two girls standing with her were the twins. 14 years. Chale, Asa, Ajefufo, Asla. 15 years ago, prophecy. That same grace is here tonight. And I prophesy. Receive your twins. Buy something beautiful for this woman. Something good will happen to you. God bless you. My dear, go back to where you Hold your, lift your hands with me. Thank you. You have made my work so easy. The atmosphere is already opened. So I do this struggle. You go to some churches and you will have to remember when you started learning how to pray in tongues. Let now lift your hands this way lift your hands thank you holy spirit lord i pray that you visit visit oh god <laughs> visit tonight change somebody's story change somebody's story i was born to give you praise all of my day. fresh favor fresh favor Fresh favor. There is a call on you. There is a call on you. It doesn't matter how you make it in the corporate world. You will preach. You. Send all of them forward. Huh. My dear, come. 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 Bring me in that lady. Jesus. Wow. Wow. Everybody stretch your hands towards this young lady and shout glory three times. Put your two hands. Shout it. Ah. Ah. Thank you, sir. Oh, Jesus. Shout it again three times. Again. Louder. <laughs> no more shame. Please send her forward for me. I can and the more she is the fact of God, the more they deny her of just one thing she's been praying for. Jesus. Lift her up for me. Oh, Jesus. Can we do it again? Shout glory three times. Glory. Okay. Glory. Louder. Glory. Now. Now. Oh, Jesus. It is broken. It is broken. 
it is broken it is broken it is broken it is broken four months from tonight this lady will come and share a testimony I beg you, can you people do this song for me? We are my banker, Sydney, me Jifu, me Chen, me Wai. Me Ura, me Da. We are my banker, Sydney, me Jifu. every shame has been rolled away your health is perfected and you are restored amen keep the mantle Lift your hands with me. Lift up your hands. Up. Receive your touch. Ah. Receive. Jesus. Fresh. Jesus. Oh. Hey. Hey. Jesus. Oh. Hakaboda shosa. has been there for a long time 
so you don't believe he is the enemy i said he i didn't say she god is going off that is when you will begin to shine if god has called me we are in july by september second week october go to bishop and ask bishop where can i find this slim man but whatever the lord would have done for you come and share your testimony here are you ready for the next level of blessings are you ready now there is something come come i i the very thing i told us of mommy i will pray it shouldn't happen and she laughed at me is what is happening i told her sweetie i'm just going to do my worship hand the microphone over and run away and i haven't i'm not satisfied with my worship and god wants to interfere he is interfering and i don't like that you know when you sing this song something will happen don't do it now born a Muslim. Hear me. Shh. I was born a Muslim. I went to Makaranta. I did everything. Talisman, Rubutu, everything. I did everything. Yet what I was looking for, I never had it. Then one day, I had gone to smoke my Indian hemp at Kopavi. Just Achimota, Kopavi. I was crossing the main road to go home at Abofu. When my father, Apostle General Sam Kranchiankra, he was driving past. He didn't know me from Adam. He stopped right in front of me and said, young man, sit down. I sat in his car. He drove me to ADB, Ring Road, and said to the pastor in charge of praise and worship, give him the microphone. He will lead worship tonight. He didn't ask my name. Nothing. He said they should give me the microphone to lead worship. I was a Muslim. And the God of the Christian did not ask the Christians to stone the Muslim from no you are not getting what I am saying that was the day I noticed the difference between the God of the Christians and the God of the Muslims the Christians didn't stone me it was a Friday it was after service before he called me hey, come here what is your name I said Ibrahim he said Ibrahim what lift up your hands so me my conversion was by force I was too stubborn to be coerced me Nilamte, to talk to me about the bible for where so it was by force i lifted my hands because when i was singing i sang only two songs Tears as a Muslim boy. Then the next song, Gina, yeah. only these two songs. Hey. If you are a Christian and you don't want saw people roll on the ground people were manifesting some were crying some were screaming and then apostle general just came and stood there he didn't take the microphone from him he was just watching me i sang these two songs for almost an hour oh. and when he took the microphone the presence still he didn't know my name <laughs> it was after church then he said i should accept christ when i finished hear what i said i said okay you saw me attach motor you drove me here. Church is over. Take me back home. I told him straight. He said, hey, you just accepted Christ and you are still stubborn. You are born again. I said, yes, but take me back to where you took Ganyobi. We don't let things go like that. And humbly, 
I sat in his car. This man drove me to Achimota Abofu before going back to Kolego. The next Sunday morning, he came to pick me and drove me home to church. He bought me a complete Christian apparel the Saturday and brought it the Sunday morning. And that was what I wore. From that day, worship never left my mouth. Three weeks later, he made me the teacher of the discipleship school. I was teaching worship. Now I walk the whole of Accra and people will see me, Pastor Abraham, you taught me worship. Now, how can I teach worship and not be worship? So you can take everything away from me. I won't fight you. If you touch my worship, I will kill you. Hear me. God is going to take you to the next level. But he says I should talk to you to work on your temper. Because you are a great woman. Greatness is all around you. But your temper. Forgive me. I have to say it raw. Me, I don't like bitters. I like raw. All those who are laughing means you have drunk before. So you know bitters and you know what is raw. <laughs> I caught you there. <laughs> now before Bishop Mind went to that. How many of you remember Bites? <laughs> hey Bishop, this is your church. Even if Jesus comes now, all of them will go. <laughs> How many of you have tasted Bites before? Oh, me and you, we are the same container. Where we are coming from is just by grace. <laughs> Do you know where I'm coming from? If you had seen me 22, 23, 24 years ago, you wouldn't even give me lift. Let alone wave at me. So if God has done this, where I am coming from? Give me your left hand. From today, I pull you out of that group of friends because they are sitting on your glory. Ah, so three ladies as friends, and the Lord is going to disconnect you from them. They are around you because of what you are generous. You are generous. They are around you because of what they get. The Lord says He's going to cut them off from Monday. Today is Friday. Eh? You have two days to enjoy them. After Monday, theme. and God is going to bring just one old friend back to you. Three months from now, that which you have been pulling for the past six months, from January, three months from now, it will land your hand. But the Lord says when that thing comes, split it into three. Bring one to this man to chop. It is not for the church. Hey, account department, hear me. What this woman will bring does not belong to Pin Heaven's ICGs. No. It belongs to my brother. I beg you, chop. So God will multiply her blessings divide what will come three months from now into three give him one to chop church it is meant for my brother to chop if you are here and you are with the accounts department hear and hear well before you convert that gift two That is why I'm not the way you have stretched your neck. What do you want to hear? That one I private 
confidential. It doesn't concern me. Can you please walk with me? You see this great man? You see this great man? Can you kneel before him? Place your hands on his shoes. Please stand around him. Something is going to happen. That which you prayed for three weeks ago, as you hold on to the feet of this great man of God, I see the angels of God come to your dwelling. Bring you that thing right now. Close your lift your hands. You will smile. You will smile very soon. Who did you? Somebody should stand by this young man. Something is moving. Oh, Jesus. Fresh joy. It is coming your way. Receive it.
ready are you to surprise God when he opens that door for you? You are ever ready. I give you three weeks. Come and share your testimony with this man. Amen. Now let him up. I'm sorry, he can't stand. So you will have to support him. I saw like you were holding a bowl and you were giving people what was in the bowl and he was standing far not believing that when he comes he will get what you were sharing and the Lord showed me that he has a heart that is willing to clean your shoes yet he doesn't believe that what is in you he deserves it So the Lord says I should pray for him. He's going to use this boy to make you so proud in another place. Okay. Here to be planted and the amazing things that we just paid for the first two years of his of the place, three years of where he's going to rent. Wow. Just three days today. Tuesday, so we are getting ready by first week of October, uh, September. He's going. We've got a place. I went. I was with him on on Tuesday or Monday. Monday, I went to inspect the place and I paid for the place. The church paid for the place actually on to Tuesday. To go plant it for him plant it. And I just put a, make, make you proud, proud somewhere. Some, somewhere, yeah. So it's confirmed. Thank God I'm not a liar. No, no, no. no. You're not. <laughs> just to confirm what you are. What yeah. You are not because there are some people when they come like that, they will come and stand by you. And after mentioning your name and everything they will come in front and call you and say and mention your name and because they are standing in front of people you can't tell them but i mentioned it to you so they are preaching with weighing card not approval of the holy spirit their certificate is weighing card he's gonna make you so proud he's gonna make you so so proud and he has a good heart towards you uh, you can't say my English is finished. That's who this guy is. And when he held your shoes, I saw an impartation. So the spirit of multiplication that follows you is going to follow him. The Lord bless you. Help him to go and sit. If you leave him, he will fall. Thank you.